Welcome back to Front Porch Catholic, where we talk about the grit and glory of domestic life on our Ohio hobby farm. And it is a glorious January morning. It's the middle of the week. We're going to take advantage of this fine weather to do some outdoor chores. Joe is turning compost. I'm going to muck out a donkey stall and let you watch me do that because who doesn't like to watch other people do that kind of job? <laughs> I also have to decide which jack I'm going to keep, which boy donkey I'm going to keep on my farm and which one I'm going to sell. Can't have two of them and I'll tell you why later. my gloves inside and I'm gonna check and see if I've got work gloves out here from last year. I think I do. Ooh. Jackpot! Insulate. Alright. I'm heading into the stall to see what kind of damage we're looking at. What is my workload gonna be? Oh, hello. Hi, Spice Cake. Oh, and the rest of the gang? Y'all heard me talking. This is what became of the Christmas tree. You guys did a good job eating that. Hi, Ecclesia. Sweet girl. Got a daily grain ration coming. Mm -hmm. Come on. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, you're coming back in? We're heading out, missus. Let's go. Got them out of my hair. They're gonna be eating while I'm cleaning. That's like what happens inside with the kids. They eat, I clean. pleasure of saying hello again because it's actually the next day I should have known I took out a half charged camera and was in the cold weather and the battery just died right after Joe dumped that compost um, dumped that manure right on the compost pile so anyway I'm sorry that I didn't get to show you the rest of that chore but it was an uneventful chore it was pretty good and um, successful I got it done Joe added manure to his compost pile I got a little workout I'm kind of sore today oh. Um, so anyway, mission accomplished. Um, the other thing I wanted to do outside, I'll just tell you quickly about, in case you're interested in miniature Mediterranean donkeys, we have a small registered breeding herd here. Um, you can look at our website, providencecottagefarm.com, where we market and uh, talk about our donkeys. But I have two boys, two intact jack donkeys, two males, and um, they're both of breeding age, and I cannot keep both of them. So I had to decide, you know, who do I want to keep, who do I want to sell? And for me, the decision's really coming down to uh, which one is the better animal? They're both excellent, but there's one that's slightly better. 
uh, and I decided to sell him because every now and again it does great things for you to part with your best stock because everybody else needs good donkeys too, right? Can't keep them all. This is Providence Cottage Carthusian. Ooh, sorry, exposure. Um, he is a micro miniature Mediterranean donkey, meaning he just measures right below the breed standard. He's right under that 30 inch mark um, and he has kind of a smaller body. So he's well proportioned, but he's mini, mini, mini. <laughs> uh, so I'm, right now I'm offering him for sale on my website um, and hopefully I'll be able to part with him before much longer here. Um, girl donkeys start to come into season right around late February, March, and uh, right now it's January. So we have to get this ball rolling. I hate to sell any donkeys, but I do also like to make a little income so we can buy different animals. More on that later. We're looking at pigs right now. Everybody wants to buy a pig for the family table. So we're looking into that and I'm hoping to tell you more about it next time. Thank you for being with us on Front Porch Catholic and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.